How's it going, guys? I am literally parked in my car at the base of two 14,000-foot mountains. We're knocking two 14ers out tomorrow morning, first thing, 5.30 a.m. I'm going to get some sleep. I'll update you guys on the situation in the morning. See you then. What up, what up, what up, guys? Good morning to you. I'm here with Joe, by the way. He actually uh, did one of these old vlogs with me a long time ago, Humboldt, I'll link it above, but this trail's gonna be epic. All right guys, so if you look in my backpack here, I literally just got water, nuts, pretzels, beef jerky, a beer. Not carrying any other camera supplies. I'm trying to go as lightweight as possible in this. Also, I'd recommend if you're doing a 14, I'll only bring one lens. So I'm just bringing my 24 to 70 millimeter lens, which is generally my best lens for landscape right now. So we're starting here. We're gonna do Redland Peak, then hit Sunshine Peak, then just double back across the whole thing. It's about 13 miles round trip. Yeah, look at this guys. Definitely an avalanche that went right through here. All right guys, for this shot right here, got the sun hitting the mountain from this angle. Nice blue sky. I'm gonna go stand on that rock right there and frame this entire shot. I really like this shot because it's got a lot of depth. So it's got this layer here, a layer there, and another layer there. So it really gives dimension to the photograph. Look at this valley, guys. Damn. Gorgeous. So that's where we're going up. There's the approach. Phew, phew, phew. All right, so the best way to do 14ers, guys, is just one step at a time. If you look at that, it looks like a lot, but, you know, one step at a time and you'll get there eventually. Alright guys, we're getting there. That's the peak. You boys feeling it. Feeling it rough. We're gonna, we're gonna prevail. Because, look at this view. Joe says we only got like 200-ish feet of climbing to go, so. Yeah. We did it. Fuck yeah. All right, guys, at the top of Red Cloud here, got a nice composition here. I really like this composition because it's three of a kind. One, two, three. These aren't necessarily all three mountains that we're doing this weekend, but it is metaphorical for this entire weekend. So one way you can add value to your photos is to infuse some kind of metaphor in them to the audience or to yourself to remember. All right, guys, so shout out to that mountain. That was my 25th 14er, and that was actually Joe's 50th 14er. So we're packing them in. All right, guys, that's the second 14er we're going to. It's a sunshine peak over there. It's just a traverse. A little further along, that's where we came from. We went down this. Now we just got to pop up that. Oh, that's only 400 feet? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Part of the hike where I'm just cussing to myself every two seconds for the last like 100 feet up. And there's actually this really great marine theory where it's called the 40% rule, where when you think you're absolutely done, your body's finished, you're only 40% capacity. So keep going. Fuck, guys. So close. All right guys, we're at the top of uh, Sunshine Peak. It's the smallest 14er, it's 14,000 and one foot. Got some nice pretzel beer action. Then we're gonna bounce. Guys, we're gonna get on the mountain pretty fast. We've got some storm crowds rolling in the back distance. Back up to the red cloud, back up to go back down. It's the only safe way off this mountain right now. So, we're gonna summon it again. It's literally snowing right now, just ever so slightly. 
little bits. It's just this cloud passing over. We're basically back on the summit of Red Cloud, the first one we summited. There's the one we came from. Definitely glad we're not over there. Look at those storm clouds, like rolling in hot. All right guys, so now I'm gonna shoot the same shot as before, except now we got these awesome clouds in the background, much better lighting. So check out this one compared to the other one. super happy this storm rolled in because it's letting me get a bunch of really awesome shots of the mountain that I wouldn't be able to get before because it was so bright on the way up. Coming in hot guys. Some rain over there. Next I'm going to get a photo of the wildflowers because there's so many on this trail. What I'm going to do is I'm going to focus on these yellow flowers that are right here this awesome mountain backdrop. I actually believe is the mountain we're doing tomorrow. Mountain can be spoiler alert. Anyway, in order to get this shot, I'm gonna blur out the flowers just slightly. So somewhere between F4 to F9, I'm gonna decide, but you can still tell that it's a flower. And then I'm gonna have the mountain in the focus in the background. So I have a nice foreground and background object. The weather is amazing. It's nice and cloudy, moody. Check this shot out. Now is where an avalanche came through. All right, guys, that was seven hours and 50 minutes to go 12 miles, two peaks. That was insane. All right, folks, we made it back to the car. Thanks for watching. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Get on my Patreon if you want to see me edit these photos. And I will see you guys tomorrow. We are hiking, I think, that mountain right there. So we'll see you then. Peace. So this is Jonathan. He's actually the first person ever in real life to recognize me from a YouTube channel. <laughs> so that's super exciting. He watched my Prius build-out video. Yep, did the same thing. <laughs> Tons of help. <laughs>